Well, it's day three on our trip and we're eating breakfast in our log cabin. Um, cool thing is the stairs provide a great place to put the camera so you can just look at it. We're outside of Custer. It rained last night, so we were kind of glad that we weren't camping out. We thought about doing that. Gonna go into uh, see Mount Rushmore. Yep. Hopefully we can get in. <laughs> And behind me there's a lot of uh, lodgepole pines and they're beautiful, they're all around here. Uh, hopefully they don't get destroyed by that beetle that carries a fungus that kills them. The uh, lodgepole pine beetle? Yeah, the lodgepole pine beetle. Uh, when we were driving up here we saw pretty much a whole hillside of lodgepole pines dead. Pretty much as a result of that beetle. So hopefully this place will be able to escape it and still stay beautiful. And it is. Not the best day to see it, but we can still see it. We just saw a video when we first came in and it pointed out that the Mount Rushmore is really, all of Mount Rushmore could be in the, basically on the head of what this is. So it's quite a huge undertaking. Started over 50 years ago. Drive up to Mount Rushmore. On driving roads, that they got this U-Haul trailer that can't go real fast, but it's just not a good day for sightseeing. No. I'm going to take the chances, as small as we are, that I might get a spot closer. try tomorrow when there's less crowds and hopefully some better weather. It's pea soup. Yeah. Can't see a thing. And through the pigtail bridges. Like a pigtail. <laughs> Sue me! Wink wink. So, this is a pigtail bridge. It's made out of logs that are um, indigenous to this place. It's They're not level or even or really anything. They just kind of help curve it around and everything. There's um, I guess they started the bottom of it. 1931. About 1931 they started this. And they're pretty interesting. I mean, <laughs> they're still standing. The better than some. And we're about to go through a narrow tunnel. Ah, sign your horn. Do it again. We, uh, we're going to do the uh, fireworks at uh, Mount Rushmore, but it was just crazy. Three miles Th park. And then the, at, the, at the bottom of the, of the mountain, and then you had to walk up. And, and it uh, was an 800, uh, yeah, 800 feet ascent. ascent. Yeah. <laughs> so we just said, hey, you know, we'll maybe pass on the fireworks, but we're going to definitely go there in the morning. We actually did, though, um, you know, earlier this morning we drove by, and you couldn't even see it. So we weren't really sure if it existed, but we did verify that it really did exist. Yes. We did get to see it uh, quickly yes. as we as we went by. And I got a picture of it. So we are about to go into the Rushmore Caves. Maybe we'll make it out. Maybe we won't.
Okay, so I made it through the cave and everything, but uh, something happened, Mom. Sorry, Dad. Kind of got lost in the maze of the cave, so I guess I'll be coming home by myself. <laughs> Just kidding. Love you. Well, we actually made it up to the fireworks. Uh, Dad found a spot that many could fit in. Probably no other cars, but it's about a three-mile hike up. But we're here, and we have a pretty good view of the mountain. Okay, this is looking a little bit familiar. Um, <laughs> we got some fog coming through, so uh, hopefully uh, they'll blow over.